Hey guys, it's Banyan here, and today we're back on Route 66 for another masked adventure. So let's do this thing. So this is kind of a spur of the moment Route 66 chip. So how I think we're gonna do it with the videos is we're just gonna do them state by state. So we're starting off here in Arizona. Arizona has plenty of roadside attractions. Some that might seem like they're from another planet. or from an episode of SpongeBob SquarePants. And even when you think you found something familiar, you'll still be surprised by the unexpected. The Hackberry General Store is a great example of the amazing places you can stop for a drink or souvenir. Check out the amazing gas pumps and soda machines, or just chat with the locals. So, where are you from? Oh, oh, I get it, I get it, so from this the Old Western Town of Oatman, Arizona is a must stop. They do a great job of putting on a show and it's just fun to walk through. Then there's the wild donkeys that roam the street that are friendly, but may bite. More stunning views and watering holes can be seen to and from Oatman. Sleegman, Arizona is a great stop. With the snow-capped drive-in, Angel and Velma's shop, and the many other shopping spots. But it is a really great place to spend the night. You'll have a great time talking with the locals and eating at the restaurants. And this is my kind of nightlife. For those who like the abandoned, there are tons of places to stop. Old motels, gas stations, souvenir shops, and you've got to check out the Twin Arrows. For a more upscale experience, towns like Williams, Arizona, Gateway to the Grand Canyon has everything you need. Disney and Pixar's cars took so much inspiration from the Mother Road. And you'll see plenty of cars Easter eggs on Route 66. Oh, hey Red, who's your friend? Huh, I wonder why he's not saying anything. Oh, he's just a little bit shy and he hates you for killing his flowers. If you really want to take it easy, then hang out on the corner of Winslow, Arizona. And what's the chances that there's going to be a flatbed Ford here, too? Oh, maybe they did that on purpose. Driving up to the Jackrabbit Trading Post and seeing the Here It Is sign really drives home the fact that you're on Route 66. After riding a giant jackrabbit and talking story, Cindy and Tony will make sure that you leave with a smile on your face and possibly a rabbit or two of your own. In between Route 66 sections, you'll have to drive the 40 where you'll see many Indian trading posts. This one by far is my favorite. Out here in Arizona, you see a lot of these things. They're called wigwams, or some people might call them teepees. But one thing that you might not usually see in Arizona is this. <laughs> Actually, come to think about it, it is pretty common to see these guys around here. We finished the Arizona leg of our adventure, sleeping at the Wigwam Motel in Holbrook, Arizona, where we had an amazing light show. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more Route 66 goodness. In our next video, we rock our way into New Mexico, where we find more Mufflerman, fireworks, classic cars, and neon.